Hello everyone, I first want to thank you all for following my YouTube channel and for those who use my website content. Having teachers and parents use the membership on my website helps me make all these fun educational videos possible. Thank you for supporting me by getting a membership. Now for some news about what is coming up next on the website and the YouTube channel. But first let me give you some background. Obviously you all know I love helping kids learn math and it really makes my day when I get an email or hear that my videos were used in a classroom or if a video helped a child. This is why I do what I do, because I know how hard learning can be at times for kids. Making this content like the math videos and the Mage Math game has been an amazing experience for me and my family. For the past little bit, my family and I have been interested in other topics or subjects. After way too long of thinking about it, I decided it would be fun to add these to the YouTube channel and the website, even though some of it is not math related. What started out as things I wanted to do for fun as a hobby, I now think would be a great addition for all the kids to use. So without further ado, here are some things that I am adding to the YouTube channel and the website. First thing I just added is another VR math escape room called Merlin's Cave. I worked for several months on this and even had to teach myself some game development to get this made. It is like my other math escape rooms on my website, and this one's called Merlin's Cave. Instead of escaping, you are actually trying to fix a mistake the number one made and help Merlin restore order to the cave before it gets destroyed. Click on your grade below and the video up top will explain how to access Merlin's cave. Another fun thing I'm doing is getting math mysteries for all the grades and even looking into doing a virtual math mystery. If it works, it will be tons of fun and great to play in the classroom as a class. I will also be looking into putting math flashcards on the site as well, so keep an eye out for those this year. Of course I am also putting out more math videos onto YouTube and the website. If you want a specific math topic that I do not cover, please let me know. Just go to the contact page on the website. Now for the extra stuff that I am excited to add to the YouTube channel and the website. Solar system videos with a VR experience. This is really cool because the students will be able to move around the solar system and watch learning videos on each of the planets and the sun. After I finish this, I will be adding more things to it, so keep your classes ready and all the VR stuff will be available for your students through the website. This is a great activity to use in class or in centers or even at home. I think I might add all the videos on YouTube as well. I'm not sure yet, but the VR solar system and videos will of course be on the website. I will also be adding some AR or augmented reality learning modules to the website. Right now it will focus on animals and science. If all goes well, there will be short learning modules that kids can learn about an animal as they see it placed inside the room using their mobile device with a camera. This will be fun for kids to see the animal in the room as they learn about where it lives and how it lives. The last thing for right now that I have been adding and I am super, super excited about is a series of modules that are called Our Small World. Students will get to zoom in really, really close up on all sorts of things from pond water to insects and rocks and objects and flowers and um, what's the other one I did? Oh, feathers as well. I mean, there's just tons. This is exciting because we will use a stereo microscope and a compound microscope. It's crazy to see all this cool stuff. For example, did you know that wasps have lots of hairs on them? Maybe you didn't know that, but now your students get to see them up close. Our small world is something I am really excited about, and I am having tons of fun looking at random things up close and learning all about them. Also, there will be mystery objects where as a class you can let your students guess what is under the microscope. A lot of these things that I have on the website that I'm putting up on the website and YouTube, they're great to be used in class, especially as a class. There are tons of fun things coming to the website and the YouTube channel, so stay tuned. Thank you teachers and parents for all you do for your kids. You really are amazing and I am glad to provide content for you. Thank you and have a wonderful day.